Hello students, welcome you all on your Pedia. So my dear students, in this video, we are going to discuss a one previous year question for, for the, from the exam controller of design and patent. As you know, recently they advertise almost 55 vacancy for the computer science and in main they are asking about the technical subject which is descriptive in nature. So this is a problem which was asked in 2018. So draw the binary mean heap. We have to draw the mean heap which <coughs> from the elements 9, 3, 2, 6, 8, 4, 1 in that order. That is important point. In that order it means we have to insert the element one by one and then we have to create the mean heap. It's we, have, we cannot apply here build heap method. Keep in mind into an initially empty binary mean heap. So how you can start writing your answer fine so first of all as you know when you start for a problem even though we have to start from the construction of the heap but still my suggestion to you is at least give some definition of heap start with the heap what do you mean by heap we know that heap is a data structure heap is a data structure like an array which is nearly complete binary when we can view the array as a tree fine so this is the definition of heap so whenever you start with the problem so at least by seeing the problem you have to find out a hint that this problem belong to which topic fine so this is the definition of heap now now how you can start your answer see <coughs> now construction of heap construction of heap so how you can start the construction of heap so first element is 9326 okay so you so you have to deal with 9326 step 1 step 1 how you can start the construction of heap initially it is a given you have to write out you have to write down given initially heap is empty fine and now we have to insert 9 3 2 6 in that order so what is the step one you have to write let so try to give your answer in steps fine so let insert 9 in empty binary mean heap fine so you just insert 9 now you have to write some point that is after inserting after inserting 9 no comparison and no swap is done that is it cannot violate mean heap property Fine. After adding this theory, now you have to move on the step 2. What is step 2? Let insert 3. Let insert 3 
in the result of step 1, fine. So, 9, so now you have to insert 3. How you can insert 3? Because heap is a nearly complete binary tree. So, insert 3. Now, you have to, what you have to do is, now compare nine and three as three is less than nine so swap three and nine so after swap after swap the tree became 3 and 9, fine. So, this is the output of step 2. Next, we have to insert 2. So, next step is step 3. Let insert 2 in the result of step 2. So, that is 3, 9, now you have to insert 2. Whenever you are trying to write an element which you are recently added, so please make a dash dash or dotted line, fine. So now compare 3 and 2 as 2 is less than 3. Even we can write some extra things also in the form of array indexes like as a of 0, a of 0 is greater than a of 2. So, compare a of 0 and a of 2 as a of 0 is greater than a of 2. So, swap. So, swap I can write a of 0 and a of 2. Fine. If you write in this manner, it may be more effective. Fine. So, after swap, the resultant tree is two, nine, and three, which is min heap. Fine. So, move on the next step that is step four. Let insert which element we have to insert. 6 and after 6, 8, 4, 1. Let insert 6 in the output of step 3, that is 2, 9, 3. Now you have to insert 6. Fine. Now, now compare a of 1 and a of 3 as a of 1 is greater than a of 3 so swap swap a of 1 and a of 3 fine the resultant tree is 2, 6, 3 and 9 which is in min heap. So, in this way you have to write the answer in step by step manner. Step 5, let insert now we have to insert we have to insert after 6 8 4 1 let insert 8 in the result of 
4. So, my tree 2, 6, 3, 9, 2, 6, 3, 9. Now, you have to insert 8. Now, we have to again compare A of 1 and A of 4. As A of 1 is less than A of 4, so you have to write no need of swap operation as it satisfy mean heap property. So as the question say talk about the mean heap, so in the f after writing the definition at least you have to mention what do you mean by mean heap. My dear students, here one task is you have to tell what is mean heap. So as we know what is mean heap, so it is a heap, it is a heap in which parent node, parent you can write like this, parent node is less than equal to left child and parent node is less than right child, fine. In this way you have to write first heap, then the definition of heap, mean heap and then start your building or construction of heap, fine. And whatever the different type of operation you are performing or you are doing, you have to write all these in step by step manner, fine. So now, <coughs> that is perform the mean heap. Now, next we have to insert element 4. So, step 6 is let insert 4 in the output of step 5. So, the step 5 output is 26398. 2, 6, 3, 9, 8. Now, you have to insert 4. Now, again you have to write compare because we are applying the HAPIFY method. That is why you have to write all these operations. Compare A of 2 and A of 5 as a of 2 is less than A of 5, so no need, no need to perform swap operations because after insertion, after inserting 4, still tree or you can write array is in mean heap. Fine, moving towards the next step 7. In step 7, you have to insert 4. Sorry, you have to insert 1 now. So, step 7 is let insert 1 in the output of step 6. So, my step 6 is 263984. 263984. Now, insert 1. Fine. Now, what you have to do? Compare A of 2 and a of 6 as A of 2 is greater than A of 6. So, swap A of 2 and A of 6. Now, the result after swapping is the result after swap operation is so 2, 6, 1. 2, 6, 1. Now, 9, 8, 4, 3. 9, 8, 4 and 3. Fine. Now, 
again compare a of 2 and a of 0 as a of 2 is less than a, a of 0 so swap a of 2 and a of 0 the result after swap operation is 1 6 2 9 8 4 and 3 which is in min heap. So, in this way you have to write the step by step procedure fine. Now, Now, see, now in the, in the final step, what you have to do is, so conclusion, you have to write the conclusion. So, after inserting the given element in that order, the resultant min heap is 1 so 1 6 2 6 2 that is 9 8 4 3 9 8 4 3 so that is your answer so, in this way my dear students you have to write or I can say you have to write your answer in a very precise manner. No need to write the theory or no need to include the theory unnecessary fine. Whatever operation you are trying to do to solve a problem then that only operations you have to mention here fine and this is the approach like start with the definition start with some theory part or the what the question is trying to say and then start your approach fine in this way you have to write the step by step procedure and then you have to conclude the final answer so this is your final answer now if you want to add some ex some uh, more data then you can write out the time complexity that is the order of n log n fine so you can write that part also but it's totally like it is not mandatory that you have to write all this stuff fine because in the question they are not talking about the time complexity to construct a mean heap fine my dear students so this is a solution for the previous year problem that was in 2018 so in this way in you have to describe the whole step by step procedure so we go with the more problems in the upcoming videos so urpedia already launched the module for controller of design and patent exam so if you want to if you want to prepare for that exam you can join that module so if you have any query just contact to yourpedia.in thank you so much